In this video, I tested three of what are considered the best tweaking utilities on the market. In the video, I'm going to be comparing the prices of each utility and we're going to be comparing how much increase in FPS we get from a stock windows and from using the utility. And the first thing that we're going to be doing is actually loading onto a stock windows so we can benchmark our FPS on stock. Then we're going to be testing out all of these different utilities to see the performance increase when we use each one. So without wasting any time, I'll see you guys when I'm on stock windows. So guys, I've just factory reset onto stock windows and created a restart point right here. I've got Fortnite, I've got all of the tweaking utilities that we're going to be testing. So the Risen's Extreme Optimization Panel, XNRL Utility and Rip Tweaks Ultimate. I've loaded up Fortnite and enabled performance mode. And the map that we're going to be running the benchmarks in is going to be the Purify 1v1 Spectate map. So I'm going to load into this on stock windows now. I'm going to be benchmarking our FPS before we test any of the utilities. So guys, I've just loaded into this map on stock windows. And as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 240 to 300 FPS. So without wasting any time, I'm going to go and do the first optimization panel, which is going to be Risen's. And we're going to be benchmarking in the same map. So guys, the first utility that we're going to be looking at is going to be Risen's utility. And we are going to be using these extreme tweaks right here. So these are a price of $30. And if you use discount code Ruffy when you check out, you get 15% off. So you can get them for $25. But if we take a look at Risen's utility, on the homepage, you can see your CPU and your RAM usage, all of your PC specs. And then here on the left, you have your Windows optimizations, network, deep load, GPU, and extra optimizations. And all you need to do to apply the tweaks this idea is left click, and the tweaks automatically apply to your system. It doesn't take long to do at all. You literally just need to left click tweak on the Windows optimizations. Same goes for network optimizations. Say you want to tweak your network adapter, you just click that, and it automatically applies the tweak. So I'm going to go through absolutely everything inside here and apply every single optimization. Then we're going to be loading Fortnite back up and we're going to be benchmarking our FPS in the same creative map. So guys, I've gone ahead and clicked on every optimization inside here and it's automatically applied to my system. It took me about 10 minutes to do all of that. So I'm going to be restarting my PC now and then we're going to be loading up Fortnite and benchmarking in the Purify 1v1 map. So guys, I've just loaded up Fortnite with Risen's tweaks enabled and we'll be loading into this map now to benchmark our FPS to see how much improvement we've actually got. So guys, I've just loaded in on Risen's tweaks and as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 320 to 380 FPS, which is really good. So now I'm going to be restoring back to stock windows and we're going to be testing out the other tweaks. So guys, now I'm back on stock windows. The next tweaks that we're going to be testing out are going to be the rip tweaks. As you can see, these are a price of £30, which is about $40. So they're a bit more expensive than Risen's tweaks and I don't have any discount codes for you guys on these. So you'll have to pay the full price. But if we do go ahead and open up the dashboard, you can see on the left right here, you've got your specs, your performance, your performance tweaks inside here, internet tweaks inside here, and input lag tweaks inside here. And to apply the tweak, all you need to do is click on the left here, head over to hardware or whatever you want to tweak. And I want to tweak my CPU. You click on CPU, click which type of CPU you have. So I have an Intel CPU. And all you need to do is click apply. You just do that for everything on here. So say we want to tweak our RAM, we click on RAM, select your amount of RAM, click apply, and it applies a tweak. You just have to do that for everything inside here. So I'm going to go ahead and do all of that, restart my PC, and then benchmark it in the same map. So guys, I've gone ahead and done all of the tweaks. It took me about 15 minutes. So I'm going to be restarting my PC now, and we're going to be loading Fortnite back up and benchmarking in the creative map. So guys, I've loaded up on the rip tweaks. We're going to be loading into this exact same map now, and we're going to be seeing what our FPS is looking like with these tweaks enabled. So guys, I've loaded up with these rip tweaks, and as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 230 FPS to about 300, and it is pushing 330 sometimes, but it's not as good as Risen's tweaks, and I was expecting a little bit more from this, but now we're going to be restoring back to stock, and we're going to be testing the final tweaks, which are going to be the X and RL tweaks. So guys, I'm now back on stock windows and the final tweaks that we're going to be benchmarking are going to be the X and RL tweaks. And if we head to the website, we're going to be testing these X and RL Pro right here, which are a price of $30. So they do match Risen's price. So I'm kind of expecting the same performance boost. But if we do open up the utility, you'll be able to see on the left hand side here, you have all your general tweaks, your hardware tweaks, server booster, game booster, and your BIOS tweaks. So to apply the tweaks, we're going to be starting off with the Windows tweaks. All you need to do is click this toggle button here and it activates the tweak applying it to your system. You just need to go through and do that for everything. So on the Windows tweaks, you can do the same thing for latency tweaks, keyboard and mouse tweaks, you can do the same thing. All of this on here, you just need to toggle them on. Then if you head over to hardware, you just need to do the same thing. 
You just need to do that for everything. So I'm going to go ahead and apply all of the tweaks here. And I'm going to be restarting my PC. I'm going to be benchmarking this last utility in the same creative map. So guys, I've gone ahead and applied all the tweaks. That took me about 10 minutes. And the last thing I'm going to be doing is boosting my game, which will be Fortnite. Then I'm going to be restarting my PC, loading up Fortnite and running the last benchmark. So guys, we've loaded up Fortnite with the XRL tweaks. We're going to be loading into this map now and doing the last benchmark to see if it gives us a better performance than the last two optimization panels. So guys, I've just loaded into the map with the X and RL tweaks. And as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 200 to 290 FPS and it's not even hitting 300. I did expect a lot more from these tweaks. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. After running all of the benchmarks, it's safe to say that Risen's optimization panel did increase our FPS the most and give us the best performance boost. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll leave it linked in the description. If you are buying any tweaks from the site, make sure you use code RUFFY and you get 15% off any order. But thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.